Hey guys, and welcome back to the Geek Box. And today, I'm going to do something a little bit different. As you know, I do a lot of top 10s on this list. But today, I've got a list with, it's not top 10. I've had to add one more. And I'm not generally going to the factuals of different games, items, etc. I'm actually talking about different YouTube channels. Now, these are YouTube channels, actually, that I partake in myself. And they're channels that I would love to see you guys check out. And hopefully find some content that you'd enjoy yourselves. Based on what I do here. And obviously my personal tastes etc. These are also people that I've gotten to know myself quite personally. And that have been a great support to me. And really helped me out in a well. What we've got a crap time basically. That I've had over the last few months personally. But it's obviously oh, I took time away from YouTube and that. But these are the people that have really helped me stay just grounded down when it comes to YouTube. So although it is a top well, 11 list, don't actually take them in the order they're presented in. They're all people that I hold in great esteem. And I just want to talk to you about why I like their channel as well. So it's a bit more of a personal one. So, you know, bush alert. Um, but basically, let's start off the list. I never bother with KD. I mean, yesterday I had a 45 kill game, so, you know, KD gets up. At the end of the day, if you capture objectives and your KD's not very good, you're not playing the game right there. You're supposed to, you're supposed to capture objectives. So, we're starting off with Crimson Valley Dragon. Now, this is a YouTuber who does a variety of content. Actually, the person that I saw that covered the great event, great event, uh, of Fortnite with the black hole event between season one and two. He also does a variety of other things on his channel as a live streamer and he's quite an interactive guy with his audience as well. So it's definitely a channel I'd love for you guys to check out. I think you'll find something on there that you'll enjoy as well as getting to know Crimson himself along with the absolutely great accent that he has on the channel which you'll see if you go over and have a look yourself. But Crimson Valley Dragon, as with all the entrants on this list, his link will be in the comments below. So go and check him out today. The wheels. Ali you? Ali you? Persona? Joker. I've infiltrated the theater. Persona on the Switch? Wait, seriously? He went alone to the Game Awards? What is this? What is this? What is this? What is this? so far away. That bold gamer. Now this is something you've probably heard me reference on this channel a handful of times before. Well, he is basically, he is one of my favourite YouTubers and he's someone I like and have gotten to know personally. He's actually the first person I ever subscribed to as a sponsor as well as just a subscriber on his channel. And does a great variety of content. A lot of the influence I've seen from his channel and the way he handles things on his channel has actually been a big influence for me on here as well. And... Basically, that bold gamer, he is just a great personality. He's really engaging with his audience. He's got a great following. Both him and the people that follow him are fantastic. And I think if you check him out the next time you can, he is, well, for the majority, a pure live streaming channel. But he does a variety of games of like Splatoon, mixtures on things of like Minecraft, etc. He does a lot of games with the viewers as well and gets very engaged. And you'll find a great experience if you go and watch his channel. So, as always, the link is in the comment below. So, check out that bold gamer today. And, well, I'd love to know what you guys think of Rick's channel, as I think he's one of the absolute superstars that's up and coming in the YouTube world. Oh, I burn! <laughs> what? That is awesome! Professor that's here, and welcome to another Minecraft video. Okay, Moist. You really need to cool down. Here we go on to Professor Ari. Again, no. Professor Ari is a great channel. Now. He's more of a chill channel, does a lot of Minecraft work. If you check out the worlds he's created on Minecraft, actually, he's done some really okay. awesome so, stuff. But Ari is a dear friend of mine and a great channel that's up and coming. So I encourage you guys to go and check it out, chill out, get to know the people in there as well. It's a great audience that follows this channel. And it's basically what I consider definitely a channel if you want to relax and watch something for a while in the background. Or if you don't want to chill out and chat on there, Ari's a definite place to go. The guy is an absolute 10 out of 10 top guy. So check out Professor Ari today. You won't be disappointed. Pretty pretty. 
Monkey Castle to be protected from zombies and all the other shit. For some people, their first taste of the game Medieval came from this particular Pizza Hut PlayStation 1 demo disc that showed off titles such as Metal Gear Solid, Tomb Raider 3, Gran Turismo, Crash Bandicoot 3, and of course Medieval. Well, not me. Moving on to another good friend of mine, the Fucus. Now I love the Fucus's content. He's always got such a great twist to his thing, and I'd love to just nail down one or two things that he plays to say that's what he does. But the best thing you can do is go and check out his channels. He's always got a whole variety of content on there. He's an absolute great gamer to chat to, and when he gets into a full swing of things in his chats, he really is a great engaging personality. He's a growing and up and coming channel, like much like myself, and he's given me a lot of support and a lot of love. And I would love to give that back to him and have you guys get to meet him now as it starts off so you can be one of the people that watch the rise of the Fucus as he's definitely someone to look out for in the future of YouTube. That was until I saw that the OG PS1 version of Medieval was getting a from the ground up remake when it was fully revealed back on Halloween of 2018. And tonight Not Ready Gaming looking for a bit of revenge. Challenging the Geek Box. One on one here tonight. And there he is making his debut last week. The Video Viking. The Geek Box. Spider Gaming. Well, you'll see if you've been in my streams, like a good few of the people on this list, you will have seen Spider Gaming pop up. Well, for a start, it has to be gone without saying that I can't just call him Spider Gaming, it has to be Spider. Because Spider is one of the great YouTubers that I've seen up and coming. He actually runs his own through WWE 2K Games, a wrestling federation. He's got YouTube Wrestling. And you will find also not only a variety of characters based on some of the people you've actually seen on this list, but you will find yours truly, the Video Viking, on those things. And he does does a great job. It's simple fun. He does commentary to go on top of the wrestling. And you can find yourself sat there for a good few hours at times watching his content. Just following the stories happening in his wrestling group. And there's a variety of other content as well. But definitely, especially if you're a wrestling fan, Spider Gaming, get out there. Go check him out. He's definitely a good guy to look at. Not ready gaming. Looking to climb back up the rankings, hoping to earn another shot at the YouTube Heavyweight Championship. Yo, what up? It's your boy GB on your TV, and we be <laughs> out to play a game called Walking. Hold on, let me make sure I got the name. I'm trash. I gotta get the name right because this was sent to me as a code through Key Mailer. Shout out to all the Giggle Bizzle. Well, when you talk about YouTubers, one thing that's always a big stand for me is charisma. And Giggle Bizzle has got charisma and charisma to go with the charisma. He is such a great, fun guy to watch stream. And he plays a whole host of games. Some more popular, some more of the indie variety and that. He really delves into a whole range of games. But he's such a great, fun player to watch as well. He's got such a, just a natural energy that goes with live streaming. And you will find yourself enjoying his streams thoroughly if you get stuck in. As well as a great group core audience that he has that follows his streams. Giggle Bizzle is definitely a man to be checking out who's a fast grower on YouTube and you'll be seeing him with a, such a big group before long as he's got such a magnetic personality that you today could definitely go and check out Giggle Bizzle, subscribe to him and check out his live streams when they come on. You'll love it. Just right here. So once I hit continue, we'll start with the story. The first, very first thing. So I'm Giggle Bizzle. Let's get to work. <laughs> Took my permit test today and passed it. Oh, congratulations, Cameron. Congratulations on becoming the, one of the newest people that are able to sit behind the wheel and drive. And next we've got Chadley. Well, Chadley is... Well, let's, let's start off with the negative and then we'll go into all the positives. The only negative I can pick up with Chadley is even I find myself with great beard envy looking at Chadley. He has got one of the most majestic beards on YouTube. 
But aside from that, he's an amazing, absolute. I just love Chadley's streams. He always plays classic games as a whole on his channel. He brings back such great memories, and he's such a chilled out guy. If you want to go in and really enjoy yourself in a stream and just chill out and watch some old school gaming and have a chat with an audience and that, Chadley is definitely a channel to check out. So when you can, click on that link below and go and check out Chadley. You'll find something there you enjoy, absolute guaranteed. Currently, I only have one ROM hack on my Super Nintendo Classic, and that was uh, DGR World. Try to complete that. What's going on, Godzilla Nation? This is our Godzilla, and today's video is something a little bit different, something we've never done on the channel before, but it's something I've wanted to bring into the fold for a little while now. And our next one is Ah Godzilla. And you can't say the channel any other way. It has to be said like that because it's such a fun name. And this is also a channel where Trent absolutely pours himself in and makes amazing content. His videos do tend to be longer videos, but in a good way. He does top 10 videos and gameplay, and his videos are so well created. He's got such a fantastic editing style and that as well. I think as a general viewer, you probably won't get the full appreciation of it, but you'll get to enjoy his content how great it is as a creator you get to see what an absolute amazing level of work he puts into creating his videos so our godzilla is definitely a channel you need to be checking out as i'm pretty sure you will find something in there that you enjoy out of the whole mixture of content that he has available obviously will be making a huge comeback now that i've been granted access to the console version so keep your eyes peeled on the channel for when that hits the second special mention and something that is going to... You're listening to RMU Radio. Ladies and gentlemen, we've got a top story this morning. Turns out host is the famous snack cake company will be going out of business for good. This means one thing, grab those Twinkies while you can because soon enough they will be gone for good. Ladies and gentlemen, we've got some great music in store for you this morning. And on to something different than gaming. Brent TV. Now Brent is actually a mixture of chill hangout live streams and he does some sketch work as well and if you go through it and find his Titanic drawing video you'll actually find you've probably seen his videos also on Facebook, on Instagram, on a whole variety of places but Brent is an amazing creator of content. He's got such a natural knack for using green screen and cloning, etc. that he's definitely somebody for you to check out. He's a great comedy artist as well. And I always find whenever I watch his stuff, you will definitely, definitely be getting a laugh out of it. Unless this is some, unless it's something essential that I really need that I can't get again, which I'm not sure if there's any of those in this game. Um, that's something you guys can tell me about. But anything else? K Fresh. Now this is a guy who does a lot of classic gaming. I mean, he does a whole variety of stuff, but classic gaming is pretty much his forte. Apart from doing things like Mario Maker 2, etc. But I also have to add that Kevin is one of what I would call one of the absolute sweethearts of the YouTube world. Whenever you go into a stream, you will feel welcome. Every single person is treated as somebody who's truly welcome within his group. And as a YouTuber, it's an amazing thing to put that out to people as a lot of YouTubers, I think, find a hard time connecting to their audience in a live stream on that level. But if you want to watch some classic gaming and want to see just a fresh personality that you can really get in and no, that's not pun intended, you will definitely though find a place in KFresh's channel. So definitely one for you to check out today. How do I, I can't figure out how to get out of that screen without saving. Oh, there you go. Just press start, duh. And the 3DS version of this game. Yo, really Um, that's so cool. I've heard that's a really good version. So, Dread might be in. Ah, oh, it's a shiny Pidgey! Oh, it's a shiny Pidgey! Right there, guys. It's a shiny Pidgey. Right there. Not the shiny we want. 
And last, but definitely not least, someone who I think this list is all balanced between people, but this is somebody as a YouTuber who has a special place with me as the fact that it's somebody who has actually helped me on a personal level uh, going over the past months. Just a little bits here and there and whose streams I've always enjoyed. It's one of the most engaging, one of the most caring communities. I mean, literally, this is someone who actually takes their time out to help care and deal with people and that and doesn't do it just on the preface of getting views and time etc will actually physically go out of their way to engage with their audience and make that personal connection with them is mama remy this is probably uh, well it's really hard to gauge everybody on this list where they sit as my favorite youtubers but if i pick a top three for the content and the approach Mama Remy is definitely sat in that list. She is someone that I think everybody who touched on YouTube should watch at some point. I think definitely I would love you guys to absolutely go and check out Mama Remy. She is an amazing personality. She is literally the mama of her group. She will mother hen you in the best way when you go into the streams. And she will talk and engage and she likes to just play a game and chill with people or just have a chat with Remy which is just where you just talk to her and everyone just has a good laugh she's got an amazing discord server that runs alongside her page as well and she also does a lot of things for playing with friends with like Splatoon with well, Super Smash Bros as well as so one she did for quite a while and she plays a whole host of indie games old rpg style games remade of like rpg style games as well and you will be seeing in the future myself and mama remy playing final fantasy crystal chronicles when that comes out Ooh, sorry for the shake there it's not the table but anyway check out mama remy today you won't be disappointed it's one of the greatest channels on youtube who deserves so much more just so many more subscribers and views it should be already launched and one of the top youtubers you can get and she's going to get that absolute guaranteed sad <laughs> but yeah there's going to be a oh my gosh shiny side stop 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 i don't care it's a shiny 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 oh my god it's a shiny so tiny oh crap Remy come on Remy come on <gasps> no seriously come on, come on come on come on come on come on oh come on give me let me finish the stream off on a high note come on mm. yes three shinies one stream yes well, anyway, thanks for watching the video, guys. Obviously, as I said, I know it was a different tone than what we normally do with the videos, but thank you for watching it to the end, checking out the list. Please check out all these guys when you get a chance. I hope you find some really great content in there that you can enjoy on a daily basis and keeping YouTube fresh for you. But as for myself, thanks for watching, guys. I'm the Video Viking, and I'm always grateful for the love and support that you guys and all the guys in this list i have to reiterate have shown me so thanks for watching guys and i'll see you out there